Hi, my name is Pan Farmer, and this is our 30th take. Today I'm going to be showing you what a Salmonella attack is, and it's going to be high level. So what is a Salmonella attack? Um, because I've been awake for like 30 hours today, and I, I don't want to go into the deep dive of like making a 20 minute video on how you can recreate this. Although I will at some point, and it will be on this channel, that day just won't be today. So we're just going to give a high level overview of what it is. Um, so before we go any further, I want you to know that you should have a basic understanding of what a sandwich attack is. Which is just like you uh, trap somebody. Well, you someone makes a big buy with a high price impact, and a bot will buy before them at the previous price. Then after they buy, it will immediately sell at the adjusted price, which is usually up. Um, and that's all you have to know before going into this. Like all the salmonella, salmonella attack is is baiting bots to sandwich attack a poison pool. Um, and the analogy for that is that if you're a farmer, right? So this is me. I'm a paint farmer after all. Um, and I'm all happy. Well, I'm actually sad today. Not happy. Because my sheep, and this is my little sheep, he goes, bah. My sheep are getting eaten by a wolf. And I can't seem to catch the wolf. My hunters are looking everywhere. But uh, the, the wolf keeps eating my sheep. And I don't know what to do. Bah. God, my handwriting sucks. And that's our wolf up here. Actually, no, it's this way. Um, yeah, so my sheep get keep getting ate by the wolf, and I need to somehow find a way to trap the wolf. So I'm thinking to myself, how do I save my cute little sheep if the wolf keeps eating them? And the answer? I make a trap. All I have to do is trap the little wolf into eating all my sheep. Well, my fake sheep. And that's kind of what a salmonella attack is. It's just making a bait and having some sort of trap set. So this comes from DeFi Cartel's salmonella attack, little GitHub page here. And if you want to read it, I'll post it in the description. Um, basically what they did is they understood that ether mine which this is what ether mine is is just a massive ethereum mine um mining pool they were running mev bots like front run bots all over the uniswap router and so what they did is they made a erc20 pool so they made like an erc20 token where 10 percent of the every single buy would go to the devs right so or we'll know the buyer only got 10%, the other 90% went to the devs, and that would be the trap amount here. So whenever the bots would buy, um, let's see here. So if the bot put in $100, right, they were getting a, they were getting 10% of their buy, and 90% would go back to the actual dev of the attack. So now I'm sure you're wondering, how did they get the bots to buy any of this and this is actually why bots don't buy anything with slippage now is because of this attack um how they get it to do how did they get the bots to buy um what he did is he basically made a lot of transactions that uh looked appealing for mev so he would do like really high slippage and really big buys on low liquidity pools and then he would just trap them and this is a whole collection on the Salmonella token of all the little transactions he had here. You can see the DEX trades. Uh, this is one of them right here. For the He took 35 ETH from the contract. This is a while ago, but he made a really big buy, and then they tried to MEV his transaction by selling right after him. And then he got all that back because even though he traded 35 ETH, it all went because he got you know 90% of that. Yeah, I mean, that's more of the code part that I'll go into later. But the general concept is that it's making a trap that you're springing on front-running bots. You're putting out a trapped sheep so that when the med bot takes a bite, you get the bot's wallet. And that's all. There's a lot of attacks like these that exist, and I know this doesn't work right now, but it's great to learn what worked in the past so you can come up with what will work in the future. I hope this helped you, and uh, if you liked it, have a nice day.
And if you liked it, subscribe. I hope you have a nice day. I have a Discord too if you have any questions. And uh, sayonara.